What's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I want to welcome you guys to a new video. Today we're here to talk about the NBA 2K20 demo. Just to let you guys know, the goal. 3,000 likes on this video, man. Appreciate all the love. Also, another little uh, tidbit to that. We got 25,000 subscribers in like the last month. I didn't even know. Um, Literally... I was just scrolling on my uh, YouTube studio creator app or whatever the case may be. And I noticed that the change in subscribers was 25,000 like plus. I just want to say thank you to everybody out there who has subscribed already. If you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you do so and turn on noties. But let's hop into this NBA 2K20 demo news. All right, guys, 48 hours ago to this day, um, NBA 2K tweeted out that they were releasing a NBA 2K demo announcement. And with this announcement, they said inside the article on Facebook, um, 2K rarely does articles on their website when it comes to blogs and stuff like that. They use their blog site, which was Facebook. I don't know why they only use Facebook, but they use that as their blog site for a lot of information that comes out as far as like patch notes and things of that nature, announcements that they come out with. But in this announcement, they said starting on August 21st at 12.01 Pacific time. Now, just to let you guys know, if you're on the East Coast, that means on August 21st at 3 a.m., set your alarm, wake up, have that download ready for your NBA 2K20 demo. Now, also, they said you can get an early start on your My Career while testing out the new My Player Builder and hitting the court two weeks ahead of the game's launch by downloading the NBA 2K20 demo. Now, they put this in a bold italic. NBA 2K20 demo. We'll address that name in a second, but let me go ahead and finish this. They say in the NBA 2K20 demo, you can try out multiple my player configurations to create the player that best fits your play style, which will be carried over to NBA 2K20 at launch on September 6th. They say the NBA 2K20 demo will be available exclusively on Xbox One, PS4, and the Nintendo Switch. Now, first things first, I told y'all, I told y'all that they was gonna give us the ability to use multiple my players without having to delete the save game data, load the game back up, re-download the prelude, re-download this, delete that. It's here. It's finally here. 2K is finally starting to understand that we're sick and tired of being sick and tired. So hopefully this is one of those moments where everybody gets hype, everybody's like, oh, I'm about to I'm about to create this, I'm about to create that, I'm about to oh whoa. whoa. Listen, you guys have two weeks, two weeks to get in tune with the game and play with different player my configurations and just go crazy. Now, one thing that I want to know is why is it now called the NBA 2K20 demo? Hmm. No prelude. Hmm. I wonder, is 2K starting to treat this as a real demo, a real like game because one thing that i want to know is why are you able to hop into my career and then go in and create a build and then hit the courts two weeks prior now i know what you guys are thinking this is a beta this is this is where they'll get all their information from us the users in order to make sure that they have patch releases and notes and everything ready for day one. Now they've done this every year with the prelude, whether it was messed up cutscenes, online connectivity with the servers, issues, anything that anybody was having. But what I feel like this NBA 2K20 demo is actually gonna showcase is of course it's gonna showcase teams that you can play with, 5v5. I'm not sure if it's just gonna be Clippers versus Lakers because this is my problem I have with that. Clippers versus Lakers, demo, it's not a good demo because honestly, they don't have the premier builds on those certain teams that players will be using at the park and in my career and at rec and at pro-am. So when I seen at the 2K event that they were only running Clippers versus Lakers, I was upset because I was like, I mean, I'm, I'm, it's cool that I'll be able to run with a pure lock, <laughs> you know what I mean? Or a lock slash or a lock, lock playmaker or, you know what I mean? Playmaking slash or like, that's cool and all, but where are my three-point shooters at? Where are my shot creators at? Where, you know what I mean? Like Lou Will, yeah, he's cool. 
but where's where's my shot creating slashers and shot creating three-point shooters and stuff like that like i need that in my life i need to see what kd gonna play like i need to see what uh freaking steph curry's gonna play like because essentially my builds is gonna be going off of the best players in the league that can shoot threes yes i may be confirming that i am gonna be a a play sharp at the launch of nba 2k20 yep you guys are hearing it first uh i'm pretty happy are you happy um i'm not gonna create a a slashing shot creator or a shot creating slasher anymore mm -mm. nope i don't want to be i don't want to be the dad of the community with the slasher nah bro i won't be dropping 50 on people's heads you feel me but check it out let me get back to the 2k20 demo so as far as the demo goes if they do not have other teams playable during the demo I won't play that portion. Play now will not get anything out of me. If they do have the 2KU again, I will definitely play that because you get to see how the CPU is going to play. And for all my my career grinders out there, that's where you're going to want to live as well if they have the 2KU. Now, we already know in the prelude, they used to show you the storyline of my career up until a certain point. But with this game being called the NBA 2K Demo, I think that they're switching up the way that everything is going to be played out i believe that with the my career thing i think that they're going to let you load in with your player create whatever you want to create get them up to however you want to get them up I, i'm hoping and praying because this was a thing in 2k 18 19 whatever the case may be you were able to spin vc during the prelude like you could you could literally get your player up to a certain point with vc you couldn't buy clothes and all that extra stuff but you can get your player up with some vc and go crazy in a prelude i hope that they don't let you do that i hope that you don't buy any vc i hope you can just put the attributes up without spending anything because i know that this is all a stress test i know that this is all a beta just to make sure that everything can be handled on the server but one thing that i'm hoping for since they're calling it a demo i'm hoping that they will allow us to really test the stress of the servers by loading into the neighborhood on the demo and i know what you guys are thinking oh that'd be fire being able to be able to actually play against comp before the game launches being able to hopefully get into a party squad up and go online before the game even drops for two weeks straight sounds fire now i know what you guys should understand from here games have done this before games have come out with betas to test online everything so from 2k calling this a demo i believe that's the direction that they want to go because they really want to test the stress so what i'm hoping is you create your player you get them up however you want at like base level you don't get the grind your player up to 90 before the game launch no i think that they'll say oh base 85 okay you get all the attributes up from here but when we load the game up you'll be back down to a 60 or whatever the case may be you spin your vc however you want but i think that that should be the direction that they go because playing offline in a my career setting you're not really testing too much i mean you're testing accounts connecting to your services but you're not actually testing the way that the game will be played online you won't be able to find out what the cheese is before day one launch it's a lot that you won't be able to figure out so i think that that's the direction that 2k is going i want to know what you guys think inside the comment section because for me i think that that's where they're going but i want to know what you guys think because remember they're not calling it the prelude anymore they're saying that you can hop into my career you can play with a lot of different my player build uh configurations and you can hit the court i really want to know what that court is and i'm hoping that that court is online now i've held you guys up long enough for today i want to thank everybody for watching this video i want to make sure that you guys know that turning on notifications is very big make sure you guys do that Big shout out to everybody for subscribing. We are gonna go to a mill. Whether y'all like it or not, you see this smile, we gonna do it. And I appreciate everybody. Remember the goal, I'm gonna holla at you guys in the next video. This is your boy IKC signing out. Peace. Yeah. You can't watch this whole video without subscribing.